the Zambia Agribusiness and Trade Project, ZATIP, a World Bank-funded project implemented by the Zambian government, has opened its third call for project proposals from eligible farmer organizations on the Copper Belt. A team of officers from the Ministry of Commerce, Trade and Industry, where the project is housed, were in Mpongwe district to sensitize farmers on these possibilities. Chisenga Mumba is a communication specialist for the project. We currently have a call for proposals open which we opened uh, early in the month of December and we are closing on, uh, on Wednesday the 30th of December of this year. This is the third call for proposals that we've opened to just invite farmer groups under our uh, Building Productive Alliances in Zambia support program that's component one of the project of Zambia Agribusiness and Trade Project. Now under this particular drive we support farmers with different forms of support, including uh, matching grants, a 70% matching grant of whatever project that they want to undertake. We also provide technical uh, support uh, to just allow them uh, to build their capacity so that even as they're undertaking their various projects, they are on the right footing uh, with whatever it is that they're undertaking. So Mpongwe is one of our target districts. The ZATIP team also demystified the funding misconceptions revealed through farmers' concerns and questions. Zatip assured the farmers that the project was targeting small to medium scale farmers like themselves and not commercial farmers. People that are supposed to apply are the people who rely on the value chains. You rely on the land, you rely on your different value chains. I mean, you are the people that we want. Three cooperatives in Mpongwe district alone have so far received funding worth a total of 513,720 kwacha. For Mpongwe district, three cooperatives have been funded so far under the Agribusiness and Trade Project and a total of 513,720 has been benefited by Mbobe District. It is hoped that farmers will take up the challenge and grab this carrot to benefit from government's goodwill. Frederick Manamujend, reporting for NICE in Mpongwe District, Copperbelt Province.